What got me into scuba diving was growing up in the Finger Lakes and being around the water all the time. If it was tubing, sailboating, all above. And my friends started scuba diving and I looked into it one day and it was surprisingly affordable. And uh, I started taking some local classes at Finger Lakes Scuba and based out of uh, Skinny Atlas, New York. And it's where I eventually ended up certifying for scuba diving. Yes, along with all the beautiful stuff you can see scuba diving, it is dangerous. You gotta be 100% aware of your surroundings at all times. You gotta be paying attention to how much air you have left, what depth you're at, what predators are in the water. In learning how to scuba dive, there was multiple challenges that we had to master in the pool before we could actually take it into open water, such as a lake. And uh, I would say some of the most Challenging were learning how to equalize our ears as we ascended to the deeper depth and learning how to regulate our breathing so we didn't go through our air too fast. For those of you that are interested in scuba diving, yeah, it's gonna take time and money, you know, to get certified. But after you're certified, your certification holds for the rest of your life. And you can look back and look at the memories and be happy that you had them.